The speed is critical, but it, gosh, it looks so smooth. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Wedged up against the side of the seat because he's got to hang part way out that driver's window. So you'll also see that he's holding on to the roll cage there to hold himself up. The speed is critical, but it, gosh, it looks so smooth. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. And I know he's going slow right now, but he will speed it up, I promise you. But I just want to run over there and touch it. Let's give him a big round of applause. Watch this. Watch this. This is crazy. Some of you can't drive around that corner on four wheels. I know I've seen you not do it. <laughs> How cool is that? What's the bottom look like? Look at him going right by the camera on the ground. <laughs> okay, so they call this skiing, and I asked why, and he said, honestly, I don't know. Joey Chitwood started it, and he called it skiing, and the only thing he could figure is that the front and rear wheels do not follow each other, so it leaves two marks on the ground that sort of look like ski tracks. And you will note how vertical this thing is because the weight is so far down that it has to be up like that. And this asphalt out here is not smooth, so he said it was challenging to keep it up like that. Look at that. Everybody give him a big round of applause. I cannot wait to see this thing skied up in the air, let me tell you. <laughs> okay, what was that like? It was awesome. It was awesome. <laughs> Everything you'd ever want. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, have you ever done that with a passenger before? Oh, yeah. Lots of times? Sometimes you have three or four people and they're all fighting at the same time and the car's rocking back and forth. You're saying, settle down, you guys, settle down. You got to reach back and do the smack on the kids back there. That's awesome. Dude, he behaved I... Pretty good, he behaved pretty good. I'm proud of him. You know, so when you came across the middle over here, I could tell you were working the wheel a lot more because there's a lot of bumps over there. It got a little dicey. I hit a spot over there that kind of told him, I said, oh, it kind of kicked out a little bit there. But, uh, you know, again, I'm, my goal is to not scratch the flag up. We want to keep the car looking sharp before, after the jump, before the skis, after the skis. That's part of my job as a professional stuntman is don't hurt the picture car. And it just happens to be I own the car, but I still want it to represent everything we dearly love, the Dukes of Hazard and that the whole Mopar thing. No, no, nobody ever wants to see the General Lee die, get hurt and smashed. That's why we're ramped, ramping it. Even though it's a police car with sheet metal built around it, as you've seen, I still want it to, to hold, the, hold the show in, in honor. Yeah. Well, we really appreciate it. We cannot wait till tonight to see it up in the air. Everybody, one more big round of applause. What a great job. James Smith, thank you so much. The General Lee on two wheels here at Mo Party. Ladies and gentlemen, we have lots more going on this afternoon. Oh. <laughs>